Women coming together to help other women. That's what happened this morning at Harbor House's annual Handbags for Hope event. Harbor House is a domestic violence shelter here in Central Florida, and proceeds from today's fundraiser go towards its much-needed children's programs for the survivors. News 6's Emily McLeod spoke with organizers and Harbor House supporters and tell us about the impact of this event. Harbor House CEO Michelle Spurcell tells us this event raises anywhere from twenty to twenty-five thousand dollars. So now, how does it all work? Well, those who bought a ticket can either shop the silent auction, they can purchase a raffle ticket, or they can buy something right here from the grab and go section. Now, the money from today's event goes towards their children programs, which Spurcell tells us helps the children to heal and just focus on being kids. So, in our emergency shelter, we have about five hundred children that live with us every year. The money that's raised here goes towards making sure that we have all the different snacks that we need for the kids, any type of just STEM activities, like we'll have the kids do building robots or making slime, all those different things. Harbor House CEO Michelle Spurzel says making sure they have programs available for children at the domestic violence shelter is critical to their well-being. They really want to help in that short amount of time, which is 12 weeks, have the kids feel safe, have them feel like they can be kids, and also let them know that there's something besides what they've seen at home and help start to break that cycle of domestic violence. Teresa Grodai Kennan says she's been a longtime supporter for Harbor House, but adds this is her first time attending Handbags for Hope. As a therapist herself, this cause is close to her heart. Love working with um, with women and children that have come from battered or abused homes and helping them find their voice, find safety and um, I think the pursing is a great way to bring women together as a team to help other women. Now, if you missed today's event, don't worry. There are plenty of other ways to give, and Harbor House holds several events throughout the year. To find out how you can help, you can go to our website, clickorlando.com. Reporting in Orlando, I'm Emily McLeod, getting results, News 6.